Today we have a really cool soundbar, nothing unnecessary and no premium touch, but maximum power and maximum sound quality, which are only possible at this size and this price. This is the Clip Cinema 800. Hello everyone, this is Pult Electronics and me, Deco. Let's go. Of course, soundbars are inferior in sound quality and power to full-size home theaters, but they take up very little space and still improve the sound as much as possible to increase the emotional intensity while watching a movie or a concert. It should be said that the soundbars themselves improve and get better from day to day. That is why the sales of such equipment in the world have grown by more than a third in recent years. So sorry dear audiophiles, this review is not for you. And hello dear rational buyers who do not want to turn a room into a cinema hall. Today we have the Clip Cinema 800. For that price, you still can't buy a complete cinema set, so you're unlikely to be in doubt about what to choose. Plus the 800 soundbar offers really a lot of sound and a lot of features for that money. I will tell you about it now. Some time ago we did a review on the Clip Cinema 400 soundbar. It is a basic model working according to the 2.1 scheme, that is stereo sound plus a subwoofer. The main speaker has two two-way satellites around the edges. Each contains a main oval driver with a composite cone and powerful magnet system, which is complemented by a dome tweeter with a proprietary horn. A solid subwoofer with an MDF cabinet and wood grain foil finish has a 20cm driver. The signal from the speaker is transmitted wirelessly to the subwoofer. The 400 has only the most necessary functions, and within its class, the Cinema 400 is one of the best soundbars in terms of sound, and one of the most powerful. The Cinema 800 is very similar to the 400, and it is easy to confuse them in photos. Moreover, the models use the same drivers in the main unit, but the Cinema 800 is a completely different level of sound. So the Cinema 800's main speaker is as much as 20 centimeters longer, which allows not only to expand the stereo widening of the two-way satellites located at the edges, the same as in the Cinema 400, but also to add a third satellite in the center. Also two-way, with a horn tweeter, but here are two oval mid-range drivers. The cabinet is made of polymer, covered with cloth and decorated with metal-like panels. By the way, the sound bar can be placed on the surface or hung on the wall. Moreover, you will not need to buy extra mounts, they are included. The bigger wireless subwoofer of Cinema 800 is equipped with an impressive 25cm driver. The result is quite a powerful set, working according to the 3.1 scheme. In movies, an additional Santa satellite speaker allows for even clearer sounding dialogues and a more accurate spatial reference of actors' voices to the images on the screen. Plus, the Cinema 800 has a larger remote, I will soon tell you why. In terms of features, the Cinema 800 is also a far cry from the 400. Yes, there is also Bluetooth for listening to music from gadgets and the digital output. But first, the 800 has not only HDMI input, but also an HDMI output. And this unit is capable of decoding Dolby Atmos sound up to 7.1.4. Except that the built-in audio processor automatically adapts the sound to the capabilities of the equipment. That is for the 3.1 scheme. But even in this form, the result is pleasing. Especially if you place it strictly in front of the soundbar, not further than 2 meters, maximum 3 meters. The volume reserve is more than enough for a small room. The base of the subwoofer is absolutely full-fledged. Not soundbar-like, but as of normal cinema subwoofers. The dome tweeters give the sound naturalness, and the volume is not badly recreated by the electronic processing. But if that's not enough, the Cinema 800 can be connected to the optional Klipsch Surround 3 wireless rear speakers, which allows you to listen to 5.1 surround theater sound with 5 physical satellites and a subwoofer. It turns out though compact but structurally already a full-fledged home theater. Moreover, the volume of rear speakers can be regulated with the soundbar remote. That is why it is larger than the Cinema 400. Secondly, the Cinema 800 can connect to a computer network via Wi-Fi to play streaming audio and work in a multi-room system. This opens the possibility to listen to streaming broadcasts from popular music services, as well as just files from your computer. The process is controlled via an application for smartphone or tablet. 
To be honest, I can no longer call the soundbar a soundbar. It's more like an almost mature home cinema set. Yes, movies are easier for this set than music, but for example the same musical concerts with the Cinema 800 support will be able to watch even the spectators who are keen on good sound. By and large, it is worth its price. And if you were not going to spend at least $3000 for an AV receiver, 5 large speakers and a subwoofer, you certainly will not regret purchasing the Clip Cinema 800. At least because it will be difficult to find a dramatically better set at this price. As always, you will find all the information down below. Don't forget to subscribe. See you soon.